हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू आवर चैनल साइक ई पाठशाला योर स्टडी कंपेनियन टू लर्न साइकोलॉजी ऑनलाइन इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट सेंसेशन प्लीज सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल एंड हिट द बेल आइकन सो यू विल गेट नोटिफाइड व्हेन एवर वी अपलोड द नेक्स्ट वीडियो इफ यू लाइक दिस वीडियो शेयर विद योर फ्रेंड्स इफ यू हैव एनी सजेशन फीडबैक और क्वेश्चन कमेंट बिलो नाउ लेट स्टार्ट टूडेज टॉपिक perception is referred to the way the world looks tastes smells and sounds in other words there is so much information in the world outside our brain and body the information has to have a way to get into the brain where it can be used to determine responses and action the way into the brain is through sensory organs and the process of sensation so the simple experience are called sensation which are closely tied what is happening within our sensory system color brightness pitch of a tone are the examples of sensation sensation and perception are interconnected process through which our brain is able to transform an internal stimulus into an interpretation of what is happening within our body or outside the world so now the question is what are the types of sensation along with vision hearing taste smell and touch human senses are closer to 10 than 5 skin contains warmth cold and pain senses sense organs in the muscles tendons and joints tells us about the position of the limbs and the tension of the muscles they are called the kinesthesis and the vestibular sense tells us about the movement and stationary position of the head each sensory system is a kind of a channel consisting a sensitive element called receptor nerve fibers leading to the brain and spinal cord are called sensory nerve fibers and the various real station and process process areas within the brain and spinal cord so whenever the sensory channel is stimulated we have a sensation for example if the eye is stimulated by the light we have a visual experience what are the characteristics of sensation the first fundamental characteristics of sensation is their quality it has to do with the type of the stimulus that produces them for example a sound produces a sensation that differs from the sensation of flavor within stimuli of same type that produces a sensation also differs in their quality for example red has the different quality than yellow another feature is intensity when one stimulus has the same quality as another it can have a greater intensity so the sensation it will cause have a stronger intensity for example a dim light will produce a slight sensation of brightness whereas an intense light will cause the strong luminous sensation the last one is duration duration is the time which the sensation is maintained after it is produced for example a sound that lasts 2 seconds will feel differently that one that last 30 seconds another important characteristics of sensation is their threshold threshold is the minimum intensity that a stimulus must have in order to produce sensation in us in at least 50% of the time within psychology of perception two types of threshold are studied one is absolute threshold and second is differential threshold absolute threshold is the minimum energy below which a stimulus no longer causes a sensation 
another one is differential threshold it is the change of intensity over an already applied stimulus that the human being is able to differentiate 